Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with Doug. こんにちは。今日は黒砂糖を使ったさつまいもの蒸しパンを作ります。感謝祭にいかがでしょうか。First, cut four slices from the sweet potato about a quarter inch thick. Sweet potatoes are hard, so be careful not to cut yourself. Cut the slices into quarter inch cubes. Place the potato into a bowl of water and let it sit for 5 minutes to reduce the bitterness. Meanwhile, add the water to the brown sugar and dissolve it completely using a spatula. Now, Drain the potato with a mesh strainer and place it onto a paper towel. Remove the excess water thoroughly and place it onto a plate. Let's make the batter for the mushpan. Combine the cake flour, baking powder, and a sprinkle of salt in a mesh strainer. And sift the powders into a bowl. Pour the brown sugar water into the center of the flour while mixing with a balloon whisk. Gradually mix in the flour from the center to the outside. This will help avoid pockets of dry flour. Mix until smooth as shown. Next, place a cupcake liner into each cupcake tin. You can also use a regular cupcake pan or silicon baking cups. Pour the batter into the liners evenly. Use a spatula to clean the bowl, distributing the remaining batter. Place the sweet potato cubes onto the batter. Sprinkle on the brown sugar. Finally, place the raisins on top. Lightly tap on the toppings to attach them to the batter. And now, let's steam the mushpan. Turn off the burner to avoid burning yourself with the hot steam. Place the cupcake tins into the steamer using a pair of tongs. Replace the lid and steam the mushpan on medium high heat for about 12 minutes. Wrapping the lid with a dish towel will help prevent the condensation from dripping off the lid. Now, let's remove the mushpan. Pierce the mushpan with a bamboo stick. If the stick is clean, they are ready. Turn off the burner and place the cupcake tins onto a tray with the tongs. Remove the mushpan from the cupcake tins and place them onto a plate. This recipe doesn't have any butter or eggs, so it is easy to make. The ingredients are simple, so this can be an excellent dessert for children. We also recommend dried figs and walnuts for toppings. This healthy dessert will remind you of a comforting taste. Good luck in the kitchen! たくさんのご応募ありがとうございました。当選された方はこちらです。おめでとうございます。